is Eva Heard, welcome back to Super Mario RPG. In the last episode, we began our adventure, and now we have a mysterious friend who seems to have had their stuff stolen. I don't know exactly, oh, here they are. You're crying and everything, I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Y yes? Gee, you're soaking wet, aren't you? Yeah, <laughs> no umbrella. Oh, there it goes. I'm all right now. Sorry, there's nothing like a good cry. But why was I crying? There was some reason you don't even remember. Mario's stunned. My grandpa asked me to buy some things from him here. When I walked into town, that croc stopped me. Oh yeah, he took it from me. He stole my coin. I chased him, but he's way too fast. Mario, let's see how you're going to take care of Bowser. I mean, I would like to, but uh, maybe I should help out you first. Oh, there you go. Wow, he doesn't stand the chance. Wow, you're the Mario? I know all about you. You've got more jump on you than a box of frogs. I'm Malo from Tadpole Pond. I'm a frog, but can you believe it? I can't jump. Embarrassing, huh? How about it, Mario? Will you help me catch that filthy thief? <laughs> so I guess you're a frog, apparently? Sure thing, I'd, I'd like to help. What's an adventure without helping people along the way, right? Thank you, thank you, thank you. The young frog, Malo, who doesn't look at all like a frog, <laughs> joins Mario in his quest. All right, so it looks like we have a partner here, Malo. All right, so the scrapbook has been added under journal. You can check it out to look back on your adventure so far. Oh, that sounds cool. So let's just take a quick peek at that right now. In our journal, we can look at our scrapbook. Look back on memories of your journey up to this point. So, so far, of course, we have the chandelier battle. Mario, prepare yourself for the great beyond. Uh, ex ex Exor the giant sword. We have big plans, and this is the first step in them. If it weren't for, your, for nosy characters like you, got the hammer. Hey, are you looking at me? My hammer and I don't like you. <laughs> and then finally, the Croco chase. Mario let me tag along to get my stone coin back. He's tough, kind, and a really great guy. That crocodile might have left down, left town. So we'd better hurry and chase after him. Mala, will do. So maybe that's a good way to keep up with things if we sort of lose our way. Hey Mario, look where you're standing. Okay, so it looks like they don't have too much more to say. So I guess we just wanna head back out of the Mushroom Kingdom and see what else we can do. All right, so here we are. It doesn't look like there's anywhere else to go. Am I not supposed to leave just yet? Maybe the crocodile didn't leave town. Who is that reptile? He was the one who stole my wallet, but I let him get away. So maybe there is more to do? I'm a little confused. Oh, you look like you're in trouble. Mario, I have something to report, sir. I saw him, he's here somewhere. He just soon passed me a second ago. Did you see him? Did he look something like this? Ah, whoa, why yes, exactly. He's the one who took my coin. Why didn't you stop him? Because I forgot my bazooka at home. Sheesh, give me a break here. Come back here, uh-oh, oh, here they are. Ha <laughs> ha, you smugs will never catch me. A snail get hour on you morons. Later. Whoa, whoa, he's fast. Th that's him. Hurry Mario, let's get him. Mario, you might wanna take this. Got a map. Whoa, if you select map from the menu, you can pick a location to jump to, as long as it's somewhere you've been to before. Sure. I'll remain here on the lookout. There are scary monsters out there, so you will have to buy some items and armor at that shop, which we already did previously. So I guess we'll go over here. We're back out the main menu where it looks like we have somewhere to go. This is Bandit's Way, whoa. Oh, and there they are already, Croco. There he is, he probably stashed it in that bag. Let's nab him. Are you trying to tail me? Go on home to mommy before you get her, kid. Oh no, they don't seem very nice. So I guess we're at Bandit's Way where there's monsters all over the place that we'll take on as we're exploring around. Oh no, it's a quick Goomba. So, whoa, FP is shared between the entire party. Should you use it to attack or recover? As you learn specials, think carefully about who's to use. You'll sometimes encounter stronger than usual monsters. Defeating them will get you lots of coins, experience, and even frog coins. What are frog coins? Oh, I'm able to block. And let's see what we can do here. We have a spiky and two Goombas. That's an extra powerful Goomba back there, so we should probably try to take that on first. 
Whoa, and we got the hammer this time. Nice, I forgot we equipped that. So let's see what Malo can do. Malo can just do a normal attack, of course, but Malo looks so happy, it's so adorable. Let's go with one of these normal attacks with the stretchy punch. Nice, able to knock out that Goomba. I think we got a frog coin there. And then we'll just do a normal attack by Mario. Not bad. Knocking out all the competition so far, that's fantastic. We win, we get experience coins and one frog coin. All right, that was so interesting. And then there's more enemies over here. We'll see how we handle these ones. What are you, the frog og? Sort of creepy. All right then, so we'll start with just a normal attack from Mario. Oh, we got the 10 chain, and we have the, the meter filled again. Maybe we should try that out. Our gauge is up, we're ready for it. But I also wanna check out the different abilities that Malo has. So he has Thunderbolt and Thought Peak. So for Thunderbolt, shock all of your enemies. Hit A just before the bolt ends, or Thought Peak. See if foes remaining HP, press A for secrets. Whoa. Okay, so let's try Thunderbolt first. Shock all of your enemies, hit A just before the bolt ends. Okay, ready? Oh, I might've been a little late on that. No, I got it, and it's their weakness too, so that did some extra damage. Oh, gross. All right, Mario, go in and attack the Frog Hog. Nice. So it looks like even though Malo says that he's a frog, he might have more of a cloud type ability here. I don't know, something seems a little up with that, but you know, who am I to judge? If he says he's a frog, maybe he knows more than I do about frogs. Okay, so what's going on around here? We got, whoa, these guys chasing us. I guess I'll go for you. I would like to take out a couple more enemies, especially since now we can try this gauge move. Toad assist, Toad stems running out to support you, who knows what you might get. Sure, let's give this a try, and this time, I got the same mushroom item again. So this should give me some extra power, which I definitely would not mind. Oh, actually, Malo got it this time, thanks. Attack up and HP up, very cool. So let's try Thought Peak over here, see if those remaining HP. Let's try the spiky. Okay, whoop. what did I get? Um, weakness, fear, poison, sleep, and mute. You'll regret jumping on me. Go ahead and try, I dare you. What, are you scared? Ha! Huh. So I guess maybe there might be little secrets like that to keep in mind for every opponent, which if so, that's very interesting. All right, we got quite a huge chain here. I'm just gonna hit you with the hammer then. Not bad, knocking out the first enemy. So let's try that again, the Thought Peak, but this time with the Frog Og. Okay, did I get it? We got the weaknesses there, all types of different weaknesses, and this bright sunlight better not fry me. I hope it doesn't. That would not be good. Whoa, that was a crazy move. We're at the 20 chain right now, that's pretty crazy. Let's go ahead and hit Spiky with another hammer. Oh, that even hit the Frog Og a little bit. Let's just do a normal attack against you. We're doing really well right now. Let's do even more, oh, not quite landing it properly this time. Okay, so some pretty good stuff there. We are able to clear out through the battle. We win and get some experience and coins, which Mario is really close to a level up. I think this next fight, we should be able to get it. So, can I not get through here? Here we go. Only go ahead and save first. Right here, no problem. Okay, so, yep, still exploring more of Bandit's Way. Doesn't look like there's anything hidden over this way. Let's fight this spike so we can get a level up for Mario. So I think we're getting the idea pretty well. We got a lot more of these spikies to deal with, so I'll just hit you with the hammer as much as I can. Not gonna be the perfect timing, but Malo can attack this next one. Oh yeah, I was definitely too early on that. And <laughs> that one was a little too late. Okay, try the spiky. Oh, there we go. Oh, and we're also able to get our attack up from that. Looking pretty good. So there we go, another fight cleared, and we get a level up for Mario. So I think that might also restore his HP. All right, so Mario reached level three. We get some extra stats boosted here. Last time around, we upped the physical. Malo dancing is so cute. This game is too adorable for me. My heart is melting at every turn. Let's go ahead and get the HP up. There we go, we go from 30 to 33, and we can continue adventuring. So I was just right up here. Yeah, there's not really too much more to do. Looks like we're heading down this way for now. Thought the enemies cleared out. Oh, there you are again. You can jump jump to save your life, kid, so I guess this is goodbye. Well, Malo couldn't jump very much. Mario definitely can, whoa. New enemies, crazy platforming. There's a hidden treasure nearby. Okay, so let's just take a look then and really try to explore around for this hidden treasure because you never know what you might find. But we need to jump on this thing and then just try to jump over there. But it's definitely dependent on where Mario is standing. Okay, so what's the deal with this? 
Whoa, whoa. Take a look at this one. Oh no, I missed. Not good. Um, Can I get back up there? I don't know. But I'll fight you and we'll see what this is going on with. The canine. <laughs> Very cool. So we'll fight one of these canines just like this. Get a big hammer hit, knocking one of them out. Ooh, able to block that just barely. Let's go ahead and try the thought peak here. All right, ready? Ooh. What do we get? Okay, so can I have a bite? <laughs> I'd rather you not. Hit you again, and boom, there we go. We win. So that was a pretty straightforward battle. Malo is getting closer to a level up though, which is always nice. Is there anything else to do around here? How am I gonna get back up, I wonder? Hmm. I guess for now we can look around for more of these secrets, but yeah, I'm not really seeing much in terms of getting back up there, but maybe I can just jump up. Whoa, we got two frog ogs and a canine this time. I'll go for the canine, because then I can hit the other two, sort of collaterally, and then I'll just do a normal attack like that that also hits the other frog og. An okay ball, no wait, wait, Malo got knocked out. I didn't realize he was so low, poor guy. I feel so bad about that. Okay, so Mario is all on his own here. There we go, I blocked that a little bit better. All right, got you there. It's just me and this one last frog og. I guess it didn't work. Try again, come on. There we go. So what do we do about Malo? Okay, Malo's back, he gets one HP remaining. That was a close one. So I guess I should probably use a mushroom with him soon. My concern, oh, I can just hop on this again, gotcha. And it looks like these guys just keep coming back, so. My concern is using you know, an HP boost or something like that, and then just getting a level up for him here in a moment. So I'm just looking around for wherever this hidden treasure can be. I'm not really seeing it right now, but maybe if I look around for a little bit, I can find it eventually. You would think it'd be in a more obvious spot though. Whoa, I got it, there it is, Coca-Cola. I, I didn't even mean to do that. What are the chances of that? Okay, uh, looks like we're going this way then. Whoa. Oh, you're a persistent past, but I'm 100 miles ahead of you. Oh no. So they're moving off. What do we got over here? Not too much, but another Goomba to take on. Goomba's much easier for us, so hopefully Malo can survive this one. Oh, there we go. That's exactly what I was hoping for. Let's go ahead and do the hammer attack like that. There we go, good damage all around. I wish I could have landed on Malo, but let's go ahead and do the Thaw Peak on Goomba because we haven't done that yet. Did I get the perfect timing? I don't know. I guess not, because it didn't give us a little insight. Whoa, oh, now Malo knocked out again. Darn. I don't know if we need that little secret thought bubble for anything or if it's just a little bonus thing, but I would like to try to get it for everybody. I'm sure as we go along, I'll get a little bit better at timing things, but we'll have to wait and see if that's really the case. Okay, there we go. We got an extra frog coin out of that fight and Malo leveled up. Okay, this is what I was waiting for because I think this might refill Malo's health. Malo reached level three. Mario does the happy little shuffle dance. <laughs> so cute. So all the stats up for Malo. Malo learned a new move, HP Rain. HP Renewal, hit A just before the shower ends. Cool, and I guess we'll upgrade our magic here because I think these, do these apply to the whole party? Maybe not, maybe not. This will just increase our magic attack and magic defense. So we'll try that for Malo. All right, so you can press Y in the field to use specials to recover. Oh, that's perfect. So we could use this here if we needed it, but luckily we don't need it now that Malo's got his HP refilled. And Krakow's still over here, still running away from us. Don't know if they're much of a tough guy if all they know how to do is run away. Okay, three more than the take on here. That wasn't so bad, that's for sure. And then maybe Malo. There we go. Not bad there either. Able to block that one for a three chain. And that's the other one taken out. So the spikies getting easier and easier to take down with each fight, which is fantastic. Over here though, another Goomba. See, here's another chance for me to, you know, really try to get this guy. Oh no. Ooh, just barely did that in time. I definitely want to get rid of the spiky first. And I almost do it. So let's go ahead and do Thought Peak against a Goomba. So I really want to see what they're truly thinking. I think I did it. We'll find out. Goom the Goom. I'm tired. <laughs> Poor Goomba. I'm tired too. All right, there we go. Uh, let's go ahead and hit the spiky one more time. And that's gonna hit the other two Goombas too. 
Let's go ahead and knock you out. Ooh, not quite getting the full defense there, but it's okay. There we go, five chain. Feeling pretty good there. We do have our full gauge. I guess I'll use that next time. But there we go, with all those enemies knocked out, we can continue chasing Croco, who goes that way. Then what's over here? We got another canine. Oh no, I gotta jump off of you, or maybe I don't. Did I get that? I don't know what it was, but we're gonna find out later. For right now, let's use our gauge move. Get a toad assist, and I get something different. This pink star, whoa. Lucky star, what does that do? Action, attack, action commands succeed for two turns. Whoa. Okay, I was able to sort of block that. Let's go ahead with these enemies and try maybe Thunderbolt. See how that goes. Alrighty. I think I did that a little too soon. Maybe not. Oh, scary. Okay, could have been better, could have been worse. Let's get Mario to attack. That's an extra damage and the double takedown too. Awesome, why does Mario keep getting those when I really want Malo to get them? Who knows? We do win, of course. We get four experience and eight coins. That's always great to see. And we do get a mushroom out of it. So that was good at the least. Now heading over here. Whoa, watch it. What do we want to do with these guys? I think just first off, hit them with the hammer. That did not chain to the other ones, unfortunately. But maybe Malo can do it. Nice, there it is. Extra five damage to you over there and I blocked it well enough. There we go. We have a 14 chain building up here. We're getting along a little bit more. And have we finally caught up to you? Not quite yet. Still exploring through Bandit's way, but what is this? Uh, This one's really slower to catch up to you. Give it up already. That treasure box is tempting, but now is not the time. Well, I guess we can take it, that'd be good. So if we just go right over here, oh, we gotta make it match up with the shadow on the ground. And then I can hop up here, and whoa, we get the superstar, we can just charge through all these guys. So cool, so we can just get rid of as many as possible, they are all over the place, come on, go, go, go. Can I get a one-up out of this? I guess not, are there lives in this game? Oh no, <laughs> I ride into one. Okay, got some decent timing there. And I did not get any decent timing there. Now might be a good time to try that HP rain, HP renewal, hit A just before the shower ends. We haven't tried this one yet, so let's use it on ourselves. And right as the shower's about to end. There. Whoa, we get a little bit of extra back at the full. Not bad. All right, with that done, we survive another fight. You win. So, I guess if we just let this slowly go over, we can get, oh no, another one right over here. Let's definitely make sure we do that because I would just like to be able to uh, get as many little collectibles here at the beginning of our journey as possible because I'm sure we're gonna need them more later on. I'm expecting that as the game gets more difficult. Whoa, I won't be the best at this game, but it's a learning experience and it's fun to learn along the way. Okay, whoa, dead end and they won't give up. I'll just have to hide. So where's Crocker running off to? Uh, Not really hiding too much, more just running in circles. He's gone into hiding. Let's see if we can sneak up behind him and catch him. Guess we'll have to wait and see indeed, but right now we get a mushroom. That'll be useful. And more of these paratroopers. And the Goombas jumping out at us. Okay, we'll take on a few more enemies, but I definitely want to sort of move on with some things for a bit. There we go. Got the Goomba, but not enough there, I guess, to do the collateral attacks. Let's go with the Frogog first. I feel they're a little bit tougher. Ooh, perfect block there. Oh, another one, that feels great. That was pretty good too, a little bit of extra damage to the spike. Then if we punch you one more time, that should be everything, up to an eight chain. That was a really good battle for sure. Okay, we win. And we get a level up from Mario, so this is perfect. We haven't upgraded Mario's magic, so I wanna upgrade his magic attack and magic defense. Even though he seems like a character that doesn't really use magic attack too much so far, we'll have to focus on that and sort of see what you know strengths and weaknesses are worth capitalizing on. But it's Croco again. What's this? You fools couldn't chase down a pumpkin. We'll have to see about that. Where did he go? He's over there. Okay, in the meantime, we got some other Goombas and paratroopers to fight. Let's try this again. That does not hit everybody, unfortunately. But that does, awesome. Gauge up. Nice. Nice, I'm getting a little bit more of the hang of it, at least for these enemies. Nice, 62 damagers, pretty darn hurtful. 
and then we'll do, oh, I did not time that one, so my gauge is gonna go away because of that, uh, but it's okay. We get a lot of experience. Malo's getting close to another level up already, and come on, what's this? You fools couldn't chase down a pumpkin. Oh, I gotta chase behind you. That's what's happening, is I was sort of in front of them. Okay, so, that was not enough for the big extra damage to the other opponents, but it's okay. Okay, our chain is still going up. Ah, but now it's not. <laughs> it's okay, we knock out the Goomba right there. We're at 100% for our little gauge. Things are going okay. So where are you right now? You're right over here. So what I wanna do is wait very patiently, right? No, no, wait, no, come on. What's this? You've, okay. Now, no, no, no. Did we get you? No. I mean, we were behind you, but it didn't quite work. There we go. Ha, your eyes are much faster than your feet. At this rate, it'll take you a hundred more years to catch me. That did not work. Maybe I just gotta jump on your head. What if I just wait here for a moment? Yep, yeah, okay, ready? And then, uh, jump. Gotcha! Ha, your eyes are much faster than your feet. That didn't, okay, wait. At this rate, it'll take you 50 more years to catch me. So I guess he lowered his expectation there a little bit. I'm waiting for you to change. There we go. Now I jump on you again. Oh, come on. You again? This is getting old. It'll still take you. Ah, surrounded, enough. You got me fair and square. I'll give you back your coin. Whoa, did you really believe me? I was lying. Oh no, oh no, he's just gonna fight us. This is not good, so we're just fighting Croco. And I think the first thing we should do is use this new gauge move here. I mean, it's not new, but that's our first time using it a little bit, so we can, boom, get that and get a very uh, sparkly egg or something. The egg shell, what does this do? Whoa, gives me extra defense. That's great. Okay, so for Malo, I think we should go ahead and do Thought Peak and just see what Croco is thinking about. What plans does he have going on here? Come on. So weakness is fire, poison. Gosh, I'm good. Ooh. Ooh, we blocked it pretty well there. And I mean, on top of that, we had the extra defense. So let's go ahead and use a special move against you. Whoa, there's a new one, fireball. Fire away, push at you repeatedly. Okay, let's go for this then. Oh, this is cool. Go, 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 go. And they repeated, we got it. 75 damage, youch. <laughs> That's gotta hurt. And right over here, we'll try um, Thunderbolt. Really hurt you with this one. All right, here we go. That was cool, 22 damage. Croco's dousing a tail fire. So I guess he can't attack here. We get to go in again and hit you with the hammer. 22 damage. Malo's gonna throw out a couple of punches too for good measure. Only one damage that time. Okay, that didn't do too much. Another good block there. We've yet to take any damage from this, really. I wanna do another little fireball attack. Oh, that one was so good. We get a perfect 79 damage. Then I go in here with maybe just another normal attack. Still doesn't do much. Good to know. But our gauge is up. Oh, not happening. Sorry, buddy. Okay, I can't use any more of those, but I can go with a, oh, I missed. Not good. And Malo might be able to do one more Thunderbolt with the rest of our FP here. Let's try it. We can do it once, we can do it twice. There we go. What are you doing now? Oh, you're using something. What did that do? It healed you for 60. So that's a little bit of a concern. Let's try this one more time, doing 22 damage. Malo really didn't do too much before when they just tried to attack, so maybe now is a good time to use his like other items we have here. We can recover 10 FP. That sounds like a good idea to me. Let's go ahead and try that. The honey syrup on Malo. I don't think it really matters which one we use it on, right? Yeah, we still get 10 FP for the whole party. Okay, so got a freebie too, okay. So does that mean it's still there? Oh, it is, that's awesome. All right, let's try the fireball one more time. That'll use up half of it, right? Another perfect. 79 damage, and then Malo, go ahead and use your Thunderbolt. Come on. That was really good, 23 more damage. How much more health does this guy have? We blocked it yet again. I don't have enough for that, but we can use the jump. 48 damage, that's gotta be enough to knock you out, right? Here we go. Whoa. Ouch. Okay, well, it looks like we knocked you out. I'm gonna pay you back in spades, kid. So we got that frog coin back. Go on, take your grubby co old coin. Adios, amigos. Well, I guess we defeated you for now. All right, we got it back. I'm glad. So there we go. Pretty intense fight. We get some experience, coins, and of course, the flower tab. What is that? 
And a level up for Malo, well deserved. Malo reached level four. Extra stats coming in. I'll go ahead and up, uh, I think, uh, maybe Malo's HP. And, yeah, we did it. We got Grandpa's old Grandpa's coin back. I can finish my errand now. Hey, look at this. That Krakow guy left a wallet. Found a wallet. Oh, that was one of the uh, Toad's wallets back at the Mushroom Kingdom. I'm going back to the Mushroom Kingdom's item shop. If you wanna join me, we can use the map to go to the Mushroom Kingdom together. That'd be perfect. So how exactly do we do that? If I pull up the map maybe by pausing? Yeah, map right over here. Currently at the Mushroom Kingdom region, at the, at the uh, Bandit's Way, but we're gonna go all the way over here to the Mushroom Kingdom. Perfect. Whoa, what happened here? It's nighttime, the Shy Guys are attacking. Let's put a stop to that. Are you okay? The Shy more. So these guys are new too. Let me go ahead and hit you with the hammer. They're just like Shy Guys on pogo sticks, uh-oh. Whoa. Uh, miss. Okay, that's good for us. That did not miss. Let's go ahead and use our special, the Thought Peak, straight away uh, on Shymore. All right. Did that work? Boing, boing, boing. <laughs> All right, well, the Shymores are boinging around. Let's go ahead and hit you with another one. Nice. Able to hit your friend, too. And now we'll hit you with this. Only two damage? Sometimes Malo does not hit for very hard. There's another 21. Ah, that's a tricky one, for sure. Still not hitting very hard. A miss, too. These guys are hard to hit. There we go, that was luckily enough to knock you out, but I guess Malo's not very reliable for normal attack damage. But hey, we're able to save this toad. Thanks, Mario, I'll continue to stand watch, but now everyone seems suspicious. By the way, look what I found. Received 10 coins. I'm shaken, but not stirred. Okay, well, I'm glad we got the 10 coins there, but it seems like everybody's in trouble. Maybe we can buy some emergency items. Oh no, are you okay? Excuse me? You want to, what? How can you shop at a time like this? Just take what you want and leave some money behind. All right, uh, please leave the correct amount of money for the items, manager. All right, well, we'll be a good citizen and make sure that, you know, what is owed is given. But I don't know if we need too many of these, actually, but now might be a good time to equip these other things, like the jump shoes, use jump attacks against any foe. That sounds nice, we'll buy that for 30 coins. I don't know if I'll equip it right now, but it's just sort of good to have these. And then the antidote pin will make us prevent poison damage. So let's go ahead and buy that for 28 coins. Um, and like I said, we'll maybe equip that stuff later. I don't think there's anything else we can buy there that we need. But I guess we can go back over here and uh, help out some of these guys, like you, uh, maybe. Can I talk to you while you're running away? I guess not, let's just go ahead and fight the shy more. And I think with this one, We'll do that, hit the both of you guys, and I'll block that perfect. I always do that way too early. So I guess for Malo, would probably be better as if we did like a Thunderbolt. Here we go. Ooh. 31 damage to each of them, that's enough to knock them all out. Very cool. Okay, extra experience and coins. That was too darn close. Thanks for the hand, Mario. Hey, that's the wallet the crocodile swiped away from me. Can I have it back? Sure, of course you can, it's your wallet. Thank you so much. Here, I'll give you this as a reward. Go on, I'll take it. Got a flower tap. That was too darn close, thanks for the hand, Mario. Looking into these different buildings where I'm sure yeah, people are still in danger, right? It's so nice to see our young ones having a good time. Actually, no, they don't seem phased. But I wanna play outside. It's scary outside, so let's play indoors, all right? Yeah, that sounds like a safer option for now. But way over here, what do you think you're doing? Put a stop to this. All right, let's go ahead and hit you with a, a hammer. Just like a 26 damage on the main one. Oh, we're blocking those really well. And we're still doing it, so nice. I'll go ahead and get two damage on you. It's not much, but maybe Mario can finish you off. Okay, I'll have you use the gauge move here, just because I'm curious to see what we get this time. Whoa, this is new, it looks like a star bit. Star Gust, whoa, very cool. Wow, okay, that did a ton of damage to all of them. So cool, so we get some extra experience there. That's good to keep in mind. And why it's probably sometimes better to save all that stuff for uh, when we have bigger fights going on. Yeah, she's right. I guess we can put it off until things cool down around here. I found the perfect place for a wedding, but now we're all stuck inside. Well, I'm sure over time, it'll happen. We just gotta clear all this up, oh no. 
Oh, wow. <laughs> All right, let's take on this one. I'm ready for you this time. We'll go ahead and hit you with the hammer. And I got the other two damage at least a little bit, so that's nice. I, I prefer this attack a lot better. Our gauge up is going. Um, and you know what, just to make fast work of everything, we'll do the Thunderbolt again. And I didn't really time it super well for an extra bonus there, but it's okay. All right, extra experience for us. Hey Mario, look what you're standing in. <laughs> Not again. <laughs> you're always just trying to get a joke in. <laughs> What's going on over here? No, they're inside. Oh, my little brother's okay. Okay, let's go and defeat these guys. Get out of here. They're causing property damage wherever they go. There we go. It's at least a better block than last time. I don't know if I want to use up all my FP right now, but it usually does make it easier to defeat these guys. But hey, a little bit of damage. If that's all we got, then that's all we got. 28 damage to that Shy more, and our HP does get maxed out. I'm blocking it, but not a perfect block. Two more damage, and then Mario, finish them off. There it is. No more pogo sticks on the kitchen table, all right? <laughs> that's for eating. And speaking of which, you're on the cutting board. This is not sanitary at all. There we go, 26 damage to you. There we go, trying to experiment for that perfect block. I found it there. I think we can maybe finish off the shine more, not quite. Okay, let's go ahead and do this. Oh, I was hoping to hit both of them at once there. Not quite working. But at least we're getting the perfect blocks there. So I want to try to finish you off and we're able to get it. So Mario should be able to finish the deal here. Nice. Okay, so with that done, we win. So close to some level ups here. Thanks, Mario. Of course, but what about my son upstairs? Oops, I forgot all about him. I definitely wanna go help. Oh, my little brother's okay. I'm really worried about my son. Oh no, oh no, <laughs> they're playing on the bed. I'm scared. <laughs> well, let's see if we can help. All right, we got the big bedroom battle here. Got some good timing, right? But not quite good enough. Trying again. Actually, first attack with Malo. We're at 100% and the gauge is up. Okay. Still not enough for the, thought I had it there. Oh, I didn't do the perfect this time. Got it. That was really nice. One damage or isn't very much, but that's it. Very cool. HP gets restored. Oh no, I was way too early with that one. But there we go, we finish you off either way. Nice. All right, so we win, tons more experience. Mario's almost had another level up. Really, thank you so much for everything. Here's a little token of my appreciation. Got a flower tap. You're going to grow up to be just like Mario, you hear? <laughs> yeah. All right, glad we get up. I can still jump the highest. I don't know about that, but you jump pretty high. Okay, heading right back down here. Thanks for saving my brother. Thanks, Mario. Thank you, Mario. I'm glad we could be of help. So we saved one extra family here, but there's still more people to save here. If I take you on, will just more pop up? Probably. Uh, but I'll keep going, we'll see what we can do. There we go, excellent. Getting a couple more punches in, but clearly it doesn't do too much. There we go, finally got that like big sort of chain damage or whatever. Oh no, Malo, I'm sorry. There we go, I, I avenged you a little bit there, and you're back to one HP. So, whoa, more experience coming in. We get honey syrup too. And we went into the item shop, but we've not gone into the inn where everything seems fine. Why don't you crash here for a while? It only costs you three coins. Sure, I think I could use that right now. Because we can get both HP and FP, which I need a lot of both of. All right, so maybe we slept through the, the shy guy invasion. We'll find out. See, I'm wide awake. Now I guess it's time for me to win big cash. What do you mean? Are you like playing a game? Interesting. Uh, what about you guys? Was the princess kidnapped by those things outside? Are they a part of this? They might be. Don't talk to me now. Really curious to see what game they're playing, but now might be a good time to save since we haven't saved in a little while. So I'll save here at Bandit's Way. Yeah, looking a lot better now. Okay, so back over here. We'll continue up here. 
and I guess just go into the castle where all these Shymores are coming from. There's a hidden treasure nearby. Oh, I see. I bet you I could maybe, nope, I was gonna try to jump off of them. Didn't really work. Uh, okay, for right now, I wanna just try doing something like that. It does some good damage and I can do some perfect blocks here. If I'm careful, I was not careful. Um, let's use our special and just do Thunderbolt against them. Ready? Extra damage coming in, we get the chain even higher up, not bad. All right, and Mario gets a level up. Let's see what we got. Okay, so Mario reached level five, all these extra boosts, and I think we'll go back to upgrading his physical attack. Go with this one, and we're good to go. So yeah, it looks like that's still not enough to get up there, but, oh no, this toad being chased into this room. And where do they go? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know exactly where we're headed, but I'm just sort of exploring around at this point. That wasn't so bad. And then maybe we can just focus on locking that. Somehow I've gotten worse at defending against that one. Okay. Attack again. I missed. Unfortunate, but we keep going. Couple more punches. Mario hits you with the, the hammer. No missing this time. All right. And, oh no. Not so fast, pal. Look at him, can't even bounce. Hey, maybe we could bounce on his head. Oh no! So these guys aren't super friendly, but we can handle them, just as we have all the other Shymores. We knock you out. I block that one super duper well. Two more damage, and, ooh, hitting big there. These guys were no match for us. And that might be a level up for Malo. It is, awesome. So Malo gets to level five as well. So Mario will do his happy dance. Malo will reach level five. And I think we will upgrade his, uh, I mean like, here's the thing. Obviously I could upgrade his physical attack so that you know he's hitting a little bit harder, but I feel like it's better to focus on his strengths, which would be magic attack. So let's do that one more time. Maybe we'll upgrade the physical occasionally, but in general, I think that's a good idea. Oh man, there's so many toads in here actually. What are those things out there anyway? Oh no, the Chancellor is still in the throne room. You may not sleep in the princess's bed. Have you no manners? Oh, I still got healed by you though. Thank you, I appreciate that. Uh, I'm scared. I'm sorry, little toad, but I'll go back over there and help out as much as I can. So nice little place to heal. Now back down here, um, I wanna talk to this toad if possible, but it doesn't really let me. Uh, oh no, oh no. <laughs> Let's fight you guys. Okay, there's a lot here. I wish I could just switch over to Malo right now. Yeah, like what if I make you defend? It won't hurt me at all. That's great. I didn't know that would make it so Malo can't attack straight away, but maybe it's normally like that, I can't remember. Thunderbolt. And that should, yeah, just knock you all out. Not bad. All right, so there's that done. Easy experience. The vault guard. I can't, can't come here to save him, and he runs into the next room. Well, so much for him. All right, so in here. Oh, there's more free stuff, cool. I mean, it's all the same coins, mushroom and everything, but definitely worth having. And then over this way. Whoa, Um, are you okay? Never mind that, guess what I found? It's a gold coin, a gold coin, and it's all mine. Oh, I found this in the cellar. Here, you can have it. Got a wake up pin. Thank you. I guard the vault. No one takes our treasure. <laughs> I guess so. I think you might think it's more his treasure. We'll go for this next little uh, shy more, and then we'll keep moving. Decent attack there, but not enough to knock them out. Locking that one. Oh, nice. Uh, I guess I'll go ahead and do something like that. There we go. Now, if I can do that same thing with Mario, that's really good. We get the two. Shy more takedown with one last hit of the hammer. Excellent. Okay, so they don't have too much more to say. I think we're in a good position though to head over here. I have a feeling that if I like, jump off that toad's head at just the right time, like maybe I can find that secret. Who knows, I'll leave it for later, I think. Yeah, okay, it's really difficult to do. So we'll just go through this door and there's even more of them. Okay, we're able to get through. Oh, there's so many, it's an army. Where do you think everyone went? Well, gang, looks like we have ourselves a new home. We can bounce around all day long, and there's no one here who can stand in our way. Yahoo, let's bounce the night away. 
<laughs> oh no. Not so fast, pal. Look at him, can't even bounce. Hey, maybe we could bounce on his head. Whoa, that's rude. Whoa, whoa, is not the sword? Uh, Clay Morton. Listen up, gang. These guys are gonna put the stop to our party. Are we happy about this? You're asking for it. Oh, you're gonna get it. You picked the wrong people not to bounce with, bub. How about that a fat lip to go with that ugly mustache? Oh no, we're getting ganged up on by this guy and all the shy wars. So here's Clay Morton. All right, well, before we do too much too crazy here, let's use our toad assist. There we go, and I got the pink star again. What does this do? I forgot, I think it makes us luckier, the lucky star. A attack, action, command, succeed for two turns. That's really good. Let's go ahead and do the thought peek on to, not the bodyguard, but Clay Morton. All right, ready? We got, he's weak to lightning. Boing, boing, boing. And I don't know if these count as like different opponents since they're called bodyguards and not shy wars, but we'll try it out and find out. Oh, okay, we're fine, we're fine. I'll have Mario just do a big hammer attack and miss. Oh no, so one more time, a thought peek onto these guys. How did that go? Boing, boing, boing. Okay, so I don't think that's all too much different, but I wanted to make sure Ah, oh, didn't get the best of blocks. Okay, I thought that was gonna go for Mala. Oh my gosh, you can't block the flame wall. That was scary. Let's go ahead and do a jump on to Clay Morton. Nice, 32 damage to you, but this is where we can really hurt him. We can use the Thunderbolt, just like this, and right towards the end of it. Remember that I can try to time it, but it didn't go super well. Got it, got it. There's still more attacks coming in. Gotta be careful. Nice, we're doing really good. Clay Morton stunned, so this is our chance to really do some crazy stuff. Gonna hit you with a big hammer, get rid of all the bodyguards. Let's do one more Thunderbolt against you. Here we go. That's gotta go well, there we go. Oh no, we got the perfect block though. Let's go ahead and try some crazy moves with Mario, maybe just a fireball here. All right, ready? Go, 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 go. Perfect. Did 39 damage, and then one last Thunderbolt on the Clay Morton might do the trick. Oh, there's more of them coming in. Not good. So this might be a good chance then to not defend, but use our items, the honey syrup, to get some FP back so that Malo can keep doing lightning. That'd be a good idea, I think. All right, so here's the honey syrup. 10 points. And then Malo, use the Thunderbolt. Not bad, that knocks them all out. But just more start coming in. Okay, just keep using it then. Whoa, that was pretty huge. How much health does this guy have? It just keeps going and going. All right, that hit the rest of them pretty well. But we can just keep doing this and keep him stunned. It seems like there's not much more we can do. Not bad, yeah, we can just keep doing this over and over. I'm certainly not complaining. But, oh, there he goes, he's knocked out. Awesome. And some extra coins for it too. That was pretty crazy. But we still have the rest of these guys to defeat. So let's get rid of these bodyguards. Ooh, there, nice. That was pretty intense. So Clay Morton and all of these Shymores taking over the castle was no match for Mario and Malo. Whoa, what is that? A shiny star. Whoa. Look at this thing. <laughs> Mario is so cute. There we go, we get a big blue star. Seems pretty significant. Maybe this is one of the ones that the big sword crashed through on its way down from space. It looks like it. So from this, I guess we can infer that there's six more left to find. This is not good. This is not good. The mustachioed one is strong. Strong, yes. We must warn the boss. Come on. So that guy wasn't the boss? Oh no. I mean, I guess seeing how he sort of looks like the sword guy, maybe the sword guy is the boss they're talking about, but is the, the chancellor okay? Gracious. Oh, it's you, Mario. What a relief. Once again, Mario to the rescue. I guess so. 
But who are those? Chancellor! Sir, thank goodness you're all right. Mario, so it was you who got us through all of this. We owe much to you. Of course, I'm glad to help. All right. First the princess and now this. It's just too much to bear. Hmm. Oh, Mario, how about we ask my grandpa for help? He knows everything. Excuse me, but who are you? Oh, hello, my name is Malo. I'm from Tadpole Pond. Well, any friend of Mario's is welcome here in the Mushroom Kingdom. As I was saying, Mario, you are our only hope. Mario, please, you must rescue the princess now. Mario, I'm in your debt too. Let's head over to Grandpa's place in Tadpole Pond. He can help. All right, sounds like a plan. Wait, why did I even come to the Mushroom Kingdom in the first place? Yes, I'll find out soon enough. Wasn't there something you needed to buy with your coin? Col could Clay Morton, the sword-like monster who crashed into the Mushroom Kingdom, have anything to do with the star piece that Mario found? Our heroes move on toward the Karo Sewers. Whoa. And I guess we can move around here a little bit. All we can do is wait here. Don't let us down. Where could the princess be? We're all counting on you to find her, Mario. So long, Mario, and good luck. Looks like they all say the same thing. No, wait, we won't let, we, wait, 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 so long, Mario, good luck. They said something like, we, we won't let you let us down or something, I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, there we go. We had quite the adventure today, teaming with up with Malo, going to Bandit's Way, taking on Croco, and then Clay Morton. There was so much that went on, but it's great that we have a friend, and now we're gonna be checking out Caro Sewers next with, um, with uh, Malo, so that'll be pretty cool. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Super Mario RPG. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.